ISA Rise being um, a program that was conceptualized in 2017, they're about, to lead a pilot phase of the postdoctoral research support component of the African Academy of Sciences. So we launched it in 2017, but the fellowships began in 2018, so it's been three years now, and we have about a year to go before completion. The Dice Arise was a pilot in 2017. The Academy back then was trying to get into the research support landscape for postdoctoral fellows or early career researchers, if you like. And through the partnership with the Carnegie Corporation of New York, we launched the ISRIs grants as a pilot so that we could then pick lessons that would inform the wider postdoctoral research support model of the academy. The ISRIs program is uh, very important because it fits into the general progress of developing a critical mass of highly excellent uh, researchers. And uh, the AES had identified the need for postdocs, which is quite missing within the educational structure within most African countries. My research is being funded by ISRI's project. Generally, my research focuses on uh, evaluating the potential of medicinal plants that treat skin infections. And I do this through looking at how does the plant work? At what extent does this plant treat bacterial infections. And then I'll also look at the safety of this plant. My research is investigating uh, Salmonella bacteria. Salmonella is a bacteria that causes diarrhea and uh, systemic infections and is responsible for 155,000 deaths annually uh, through diarrhea and uh, 388,000 deaths through infections in Africa alone. ISRI's program has funded me uh, in uh, valorizing of medicinal plants. This research is important because it is giving solutions to life. The research that has been funded by ISRI is the development of low-cost titanium alloys for land-based applications. But when I talk about land-based, I'm particularly interested in developing biomedical implants for treatment of bone fractures or maybe dental problems. I'm working with a natural medicinal plant with the title of formulation of the product from Comifora Swanatoni resin for medical use. When I say medical use, it means for human and livestock. What inspires me to do this research? First, I had this ambition of become a good researcher. Uh, when you have a good scientist, you have a good problem solver. We have problems on the continent that need to be solved by good scientists. Many of these young people want to work on the continent, want to live on the continent, but they need the resources to be able to do science that is competitive globally. The postdoc on the continent is critical. It cannot be overemphasized. Unfortunately, we are not getting to do more. So the, I think the ISR Rice uh, project gives a very good case study of why it is important to really do much of these things on the continent. One of the aspirations of the ISRI's postdoctoral fellowship was to see these early career researchers transition to being made to established career researchers on the continent, already commanding quite uh, a bit of expertise and instruction in their fields. Our anticipation is that they will now begin to take their spaces in their research fields and already begin to provide leadership, you know, research leadership in their fields, nurturing younger researchers that are coming after them, but also fitting into the policy space because, as you know, we need science to inform policy. And the fact that some of them are already involved in that space makes me very proud.